Hey guys, Jay Hoyt here. Before this video gets started, I just want to say thank you guys for all the support across all of the channels and platforms, but here on YouTube. The majority of you guys are not subscribed. So if you haven't yet, or if you're brand new to my channel, make sure you hit the subscribe button down below as we have another banging video breaking down another amazing play here on Fortnite Battle Royale. What's going on guys? Jay Hoyt back with you. Today, welcome back to Fortnite Battle Royale. We have another big brain play that happened once again. I had such a great time making the last one, so I wanted to make another one. So uh, this is a little bit of a crazy situation where a lot happens at once. The last one was just a big brain play. We played it really strategically this time. It's chaos. We're playing in trios with Ben and Molly, two of my best friends, and it's absolutely crazy. So I want to get right into it. So here we are inside the game. So again, let's give you some context. What's going on? So uh, we have a decent game going, you know, nothing really crazy high kill right now. But I personally have four eliminations. That squad has 10 in total. And uh, like I said, I'm playing with Ben and Molly, two of my best friends of all time here. And uh, we're, we're rocking out towards Salty Towers. And uh, this is where it gets absolutely crazy. So I don't remember how many teams are left in this situation. Uh, but let's just get right into it. Let's play it. Break it down as we go through it. So let's hit the play button. Let's get right into it. So uh, I have the, one of the new sniper rifles, the Storm Scout. It's an exotic weapon that tells you where the zone is going to close on and move to next. So as you look in the bottom left hand side of the screen, you see all those little circles and the dot and the, and the purple and everything. So the purple is the Storm the bigger white circle is the current uh, zone, and then the, the smaller circle inside of the white circle is going to be the next zone. So uh, we are the little dot, or uh, I think that's me, I'm guessing that's me anyway, since I'm the one holding the sniper. And uh, we want to position ourselves so we're in that next, next zone. So that way we're safe no matter what. We won't have to move, we won't have to rotate, we won't have to do anything. We're just kind of base up, look for the elimination, snipe them, shoot them, whatever it takes to take them out. So let's get into it. Let's play it out here. So uh, we build our one by ones here, build our bases. And of course I have two sniper rivals because you know why the heck not. So uh, we came upon this absolute palace of a build battle that was, um, I'm guessing, an old fight. So that probably means there's some pretty cracked players or maybe they got eliminated already. We weren't really sure. So uh, we end up seeing this guy over here picking apples or whatever the heck this guy was doing. So of course, I take a shot at him. Uh, just try to snap onto him, get that early knock or elimination. Now, obviously, we didn't know if he was uh, a solo or not. So Molly ends up getting knocked in this situation. And uh, I believe Ben goes for the revive here in a second. Yeah, she's down over to my right or down to my right, I should say. And uh, someone else gets sniped from somewhere. We don't know. So I absolutely laser this guy. They get knocked. We know there's another guy in this circle. Of course, Molly's still bleeding out. But you know what? We'll just leave her there for now. So that way we can try to keep these guys back. Keep them off the top of us. And uh, see what happens. So yeah, he's trying to jump over to my right there. So my job right now is to keep these guys back. But unfortunately, Bloom didn't get the best of me here. And uh, of course, he absolutely lasers me down to 64 health. And uh, I don't really have a lot of healing this game, right? Last breakdown I did, I had tons of healing. I had everything I could possibly need. But this time, I only had the three minis. Now we're down to one. And uh, of course, these guys are kind of chilling back here. So uh, let's keep it going here. So we laser the one guy. One guy gets eliminated, I believe. The one guy knocked originally. And here we go. So here's the, the stats right here. So uh, you can see that there's seven players left. That's including the three that are on my squad. But that means there's three teams left some basic math gives us how many players four remaining players which are not us so it's at least a 2v2 or it's definitely a 2v2 uh versus our three so that's where we sit right now of course you can see the uh, eliminations ben what are you doing get your kills up there bro but uh of course these guys are still right in front of us so we know there's another team you know obviously i don't have the comms here but we know that at this time i, I make it known that there's three teams left seven people alive Basic math, four people left, 2v2, v3, 
And uh, of course, these guys end up burning down their house or their palace. But of course, brick and metal doesn't, uh, you know, break. So they're kind of fine there. So we know where this one team is. We're still unsure of where the second team is. Uh, but eventually we realize that they're actually in back of this team, which uh, only helps us out because now we don't have to focus on getting, uh, you know, shot in the back or the side or anything. Uh, but of course, this guy comes flying over there. Not really sure what he's doing. So I make sure the squad knows that, um, you know, he's going that way. And uh, yeah, we're still sitting in our base. Still doing that. So Ben ends up getting knocked now. So uh, ben, ben saved Molly. Molly saves Ben. Or I guess I saved Ben in this situation. So uh, she's, I guess, building up there. I guess. I don't really know. But uh, of course, I save Ben since I'm the one that's closest to her, uh, to him. And uh, of course, I just build out so that way he can heal and uh, and try to get back in this fight. So there's still seven people left. So no one has died yet. Uh, unfortunately, so I think someone a couple people have gotten knocked, but I don't think anyone has died officially uh, Or I should say getting taken out. So we get sprayed. Oh, I get sprayed down almost to the bottom Ben's still on really low health uh, Molly ends up losing most of her health as well and we're all hurting for heals like badly like I only have one uh, one mini left uh, We end up shooting this guy down now. I get knocked so uh, <laughs> Like I said, it's a crazy situation where uh, I think Molly ends up saving me here Remember, I say or Ben saved Molly. I saved Ben. Molly saved me. So it's a big circle of all of us saving each other. Uh, so I see this guy in front of me. I get him white health. Get him down to probably like three quarters, maybe half health, uh, depending on what he got. So Ben and Molly both get taken out. So this is where the crazy situation happens. So remember what the situation was. It was a three v two v two. And Ben and Molly are both knocked, right? And I'm not in the greatest situation either. I mean, I have, what, 800, 900 mats in total. Uh, I have decent guns. I have two snipers. But I have no heals right now. So what I didn't realize in the moment was Molly actually dropped me a med kit. And I guess I didn't realize it until, like, well, she told me after the game. But I didn't realize it in the moment. So I ended up dropping down here. Now, let's keep playing it here. So there's still what if there's our three so there's still four people that are alive uh you know not being knocked that i know of so i know it's a crazy situation i need to get down turtle up try to find some heals and uh you know try to just not die so this is where the play continues so uh i see all these guys up ahead of me so i see this guy coming down here i don't know if he was going for the med kit or if he just happened to drop down there but we take out the first guy, which is absolutely huge. I see the med kit, which is like huge. Cause now I, I'm like, okay, I can get up to full health. Just kidding. There's two guys that drop on my head. So I'm like, well, uh, I guarantee one of these guys saw me. So now I need to hide. I need to challenge them. I need to do anything, but probably what I do. And that's take out the first guy. Well, get him really weak. Super clutch building with him missing a ton of shots mind you and uh, i knocked the first guy uh the second guy gets taken out underneath me somehow i start popping a med kit now this is where i was still so confused because i as i'm popping the med kit i knew the guy underneath me died so that's the situation i look up to the right i see four people left right i'm one of them and i totally didn't realize i, I thought molly and ben were dead already right so i thought they were just out of the game so i thought it was a 1v3 then after I pop this med kit after these six seconds, I'm like, all right, I can't really go for this save on either of these guys because most likely it's not going to be a good situation, but I see the footsteps underneath me. So I don't know where they are, but I know they're underneath me somewhere. So I'm like, well, this guy just died underneath me. I see the minis through the board, but what was that? I see him down to my right. So I'm like, all right, let me get these minis. Let's get this, uh, you know, this loot and stuff and let me heal up and then try to fight him, right? Because I have a hundred health. And I don't know how many minis are there, but it's at least 125. It's way better than the situation I was in five seconds ago when I was at 30. So this is going to be a good fight once I get those minis, right? Wrong. So I end up grabbing a AR instead of the minis. And I'm like, well, that's the end of me. So like, GG's, let's get in the next game. Just kidding. Let's keep playing here. So I hit him for 30. Now, I don't know how, you know, healthy this guy is. I don't know what his shield's at. I don't know anything. So I, just, I knock some of his shield off. I knock 30 off. So I'm like, well, you know, I did something, but most likely this guy's gonna, he's gonna eliminate me, right? Nope. Just kidding. So I don't know where this guy went. He ends up jumping behind me 
and dropping me down to 12 health, right? So I'm like, at this point, I'm screwed, right? Like, there's no way I can do anything here, right? 12 health, no heals. I have five guns in my inventory. There's nothing I can do. Just kidding. We're going to hit him with a 57 dome shot, headshot, elimination, taking this guy out. And somehow, somehow in this situation, we come out with the victory. I went insane. I, I literally went insane. I think I broke both Molly's and Ben's eardrums because I was so hyped. Because like I said, I thought it was a 1v3. I didn't realize those guys were still knocked. And uh, it was an absolutely incredible situation. A uh, relatively unwinnable situation. But the circle of life, the circle revive ended up helping us out. We all kind of saved each other. And if one of those doesn't happen, none of those would have happened. So it was an absolutely crazy situation nonetheless. But of course, if you did enjoy, hit that like button down below. If, what did you think? Let me know your thoughts and comments down below in that comment section. And if you're like the majority of people who haven't yet, make sure you hit that subscribe button down below, whether you're new or if you've been around for a little while watching the videos, hit that subscribe button down below if you haven't yet. As always, guys, we'll see you in the next one.